The Pittsburgh Steelers have cut Jeff Reed. He began the season as one of the ten most accurate kickers in NFL history since then. Been very erratic. Reed will be replaced by Sean Sweezum. He missed a 26-yard field goal against the Patriots Sunday. There are over 15,000 high school football coaches in the country, and most of them are men. ESPN 760's Jason Pugh has the story of one female coach who is bucking the trend. They say once a coach, always a coach. That's certainly been the case for Okeechobee assistant Melissa Tomlinson. She's been around the game of football for as long as she can remember. I've always been on the sideline with my brothers playing football um, or keeping stats or something, something to keep me around it. And, of course, I grew up in the SEC, so football in my family was incredible. I had an aunt from Alabama. My dad was from Ole Miss. I went to state. So during, the, during football time, it was, it was pretty nasty around my house. Tomlinson's path to the sidelines wasn't easy. Her dream of becoming a college football coach in the SEC was met with great criticism by her peers. The few head coaches she talked to didn't have a place for her on the staff. So Tomlinson did the next best thing, become a sports reporter. There she gained access to coaches and eventually was pointed in the right direction to pursue her dream. Now in her third year as the receivers and special teams coach at Okeechobee High School, Tomlinson still remembers what all the doubters said. She's just doing the laundry, which I was, uh, helping with the training, uh, and I was. But at the same time, I was... Um, Getting to know these football players, getting to, I was running with them, the acceptance of me being a part of what they were doing, and that's what it's all about. Growing up, she played just about every sport out there. She even was the mascot for the football team in college. And although the other coaches on the staff respect her work ethic and talent, She's still the butt of a few jokes. You know, they make fun of me sometimes when I'm trying to uh, put my hair in a ponytail come game day. Um, but, you know, I, I don't. I tell them, I go, do we all have to be ugly like you guys? You know. <laughs> this Friday, Tomlinson and the Okeechobee Brahmins will play at least one more game this season where the team faces Hollywood Hills in the playoffs. I'm Jason Pugh reporting for ESPN 760 on WPTV News Channel 5.